the summer theme of the wisdom of God or godly wisdom, I went about it this year attacking it in kind of a counter to what earthly wisdom. How do people answer specific questions that have to do with purpose in life and identity in the world today? Common type of answers versus then how does the Bible and how does God answer those things? And some of the questions I used is who is God? And who are we as humans? What is good? And then why are we here? Why are we here on this earth? Why are we here? What is kind of our purpose? And so in that you get both identity and purpose of life and really showing high school kids the difference of those things. This is what it looks like to normal humans who don't have God, who don't have the Bible, who don't use it, and then really digging into what the Bible says and what God tells us those things are. And that we can get our identity in Jesus Christ and our purpose is to live for him. I think the reason I keep coming back here is one, it fits my ministry style and my gifts, which is relational ministry. And I truly believe the best way to get serious about God is through relationships. You can try to grow in your relationship with God by yourself. You can have do in-depth Bible study, you can pray, and you can grow. But the model that Jesus lays out in the New Testament is for them to work together. He taught his disciples about how to start the church and how to work together through fellowship and reading the word and prayer and eating together. And that's what you do at camp. You fellowship, that's the fun place. You play games, you hang out in the cabin. You know, kids are playing signs this game for hours and they're just hanging out with each other and having a blast. And you eat and you break bread together. And then you go to chapel and you get serious. And so you dig into the word and you take time to pray in cabin devos and with tag time. And it's just, I think, Camp ministry is a great, especially this camp, that fun place to get serious. It is a place that models the Acts 2 model because all of the four aspects that they were supposed to do happen at this place. And that's why I keep coming back is because it reminds me of what being a Christian is supposed to be. And to let God use my talents to further his kingdom, man, that's, that's so appealing and I want to be a part of that.